What is up guys, welcome back to the second play review of the day. If you guys missed my first one, it was an Inform Eto. Make sure you check out if you're thinking of purchasing him. Now we're going to be looking at Inform Vidal. He looks like a complete midfielder or whatever you're going to put him. You can play him as a striker if you want. But his high and high attacking work rate and defending work rate can be a bit of a problem. But before I begin, if you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your coin, check out battlelay.com. Their link will be in the description. Use the code ETONY to get 5% off. Now, Inform Vidal, I played him as a center attacking midfielder fielder because look at his dribbling look at his pace he has everything you actually need for a center attack in mid and I've asked you guys on numerous videos what do you want your center attack in mid to be good at some people say mid, uh, like they want him to have good dribbling they want him to have good shot they don't care about his pace some people care about the pace so it really comes down to what you want from Inform Vidal because you can experiment with him in numerous positions you can try him out as a central defensive midfielder I try out his non inform as a central defensive and midfielder he is really really solid in that position but the inform I tried him as a center attacking midfielder because I feel he's going to be wasted in that central defensive midfielder role you're not going to be taking advantage of his shot you're not going to be taking advantage of his pace you're not going to be taking advantage of many things and I think up there when he's attacking he's going to be more effective even though he has that high attacking work rate and high defensive work rate so it really doesn't matter which position you're going to put him in he can be out position in any of those positions now his inform has really good strength and aggression and you'll see this highlight in many of the clips I have put in this video where defenders are just trying to push him off and he still gets the shot on target or he will work the goalkeeper so he is very effective especially from taking corners because the goalkeeper will parry it and Vidal will be ready outside the penalty area waiting to blast it past the keeper and into the back of the net you will see this a couple of times in this video so four star weak foot three star skills so for a center attack midfielder he has very good dribbling very good pace very good finisher good strength and very good aggression four star weak foot very good heading and height really good finesse shots very good shot power and long shots the only thing is if you like the skill he has three star skills so if you like your center attack and midfielder to have over that then you won't really like him but for a center attack and midfielder Vidal is very very good he is out of position sometimes but it happens on a rare occasion when he's out of position in that you know center attack and midfielder role don't try him out as a striker I felt he was way too out of position most of the time so you can't really play him as a striker even his um, even though his stats are really awesome but I couldn't because like Alves he has high attacking and low defending this guy is just way to our position so hope you guys enjoyed this review if you did i'd really appreciate a like now if you purchased inform vidal let me know in the comment section below which position you would play him in and also guys don't forget to drop a comment in the comment section below let me know who you want me to review from the new team of the week because there is a lot of awesome players i really want to try out and let you know my opinion on so hope you guys enjoyed this review if you did please give it a thumbs up and i hope you guys have a very nice day